In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to render wireframes in Maya. To, to start off, we need to load the Vector Render plugin. You'll find it in the plugin manager, and it's called VectorRender.mll. Check Loaded and Auto Load. By checking Auto Load, this plugin will automatically be loaded when you restart Maya, so you won't have to do this step again. So you can now click Close. Vector Render is basically another rendering program like Mentoray, but unlike Mentoray, it can render vectors. And also, it renders wireframes. So, we're going to make it our current renderer. We're going to go to Window, Rendering Editors, Render Settings. Under Render Using, we're going to set it to Maya Vector. Under the Image Format, you can now see the new vector file formats. Go to the Maya Vector tab and uncheck Fill Objects. We're not rendering the objects, we only want to render the wireframe. So we're going to roll down to Edge Options and check Include Edges. Now the Edge Weight preset is basically the thickness of the lines. Normally you'll just want to leave those to hairlines. Now we also want to uncheck Outlines at Intersections. Close the window and take a quick test rendering. The screen appears black, but when we display the alpha channel, we can see it rendered an outline of our model. To fix this, we're going to force go to View, Select Camera, and open the Attributes Editor, and set the background color to white so we can see our black lines. Now I'll take another test render. Turn off the alpha channel. Okay, so now we can see our object. The problem is, it's still rendering the outlines. We want to render the wireframe, so we're going to close the render view, select our object, and go to Normals, Harden Edges. This will define all the edges on the model, so now when we render, they'll come up as a wireframe. I'm going to reposition the camera so we can get a better look at this. There we go. Now, in the render view, we're not looking at a vector, we're looking at a normal bitmap. To render a vector out of Maya Vector, you need to do a batch render. I'll show you how to do that. Reopen the render settings. Go back to the Common tab. And give the file a name. And now set it to a vector image for format. You can select whichever one you can use. I'll be using an SVG. Now you can close this, go to the rendering menu set, then go to render, batch render. You'll be able to see in the script editor the rendering, rendering through the files. Now all that's left is opening the file. Here's the file in Inkscape. Like a true vector, you can zoom into it, and you won't get any pixelated edges, as it's a vector. Thanks for watching this tutorial. Oh, and by the way, the path will be listed.